We're joined by Tom Lauder, Chairman and CEO of Colonial Properties Trust. Tom, thank you for joining us. Pleasure, Alan. 2009 was a year when a lot of companies were trying to recapitalize their balance sheets. How did that affect Colonial Properties? Well, thank you for asking the question. We made a lot of progress in 2009, and I think the investors have responded very positively with the progress we did make. We raised over $150 million in new equity. We sold over $100 million of non-core properties to reduce uh, debt. We financed some $500 million in new Fannie Mae uh, mortgages on our apartments to extend our maturities and, and help uh, lengthen the maturities on our balance sheet. And with that same money, we purchased some $550 million of our bonds uh, that were coming due in the next few years. So the balance sheet really is set up in great shape this year. We made a lot of progress. In 2009. And I know that your company has been making a transition from a diversified platform to a multifamily platform. Can you tell us a little bit about how that transition's gone? Well, I'll, I'll do that. We've been public some 16 years, and we, when we uh, uh, came public in 1993, where we were a very entrepreneurial uh, real estate company that had developed a lot of different products. And so when we came to the public markets, we were a diversified company, and as recent as five years ago, we were probably 40, 40, and 20 percent uh, invested in multifamily, retail, and office buildings. And since that time, we have evolved into a multifamily uh, REIT with about 75 percent of our net operating income coming out of the apartment area. And our goal over the next few years, very short time, is to get that to 90 percent. And what kind of reaction have you had from the uh, investment community and analysts? Well, again, just like improving the balance sheet, where we delevered the company some 500 basis points last year, they have responded in a very much in a positive way with the simplification of the business model and focusing on our strength, which was the multifamily area in the southeast and the southwest. All right. Well, thank you very much for joining us, Tom. Happy to be here. For more information on this and other REIT news and analysis, check out REIT.com.